My name is Sam Kern, and I will be graduating with an economics major and business and Spanish minor at Suwanee. Service is about people. It is about connecting and building friendships. Regardless the amount of money an organization is able to raise, the amount of service hours you are able to put in, or the total number of people you serve, people are remembered most by the friendships they are able to create. Here is my Suwanee story. In August of 2015, I left Sciencesville, Indiana, and stepped foot on Sewanee's campus, unsure what the next four years would bring for me and my college experience. After a successful four years at Zionsville and determined to make a positive impact on Sewanee, I asked myself, how will I leave my positive mark? One key driver to my success in high school was my identical twin brother, Matt. Matt and I pushed each other every step of the way throughout our childhood and discovered the benefits of having a friendship that could challenge and push you. Neck and neck in nearly all disciplines of our life, friends, coaches, and teachers quickly came to refer to us as the Kern Bros, even the Colonels, rather than Matt or Sam. After I chose to attend Suwanee and Matt chose to attend Bradley University in Peoria, Illinois, the interdependent lives we had been fortunate enough to have growing up during our childhood became no more. We were 800 miles apart. The Kern Bros became Kern, and the support and competition Matt continuously challenged me with no longer came from him. I was confronted with a need to discover new friendships and people that would help me have the positive academic and community impact I was determined to make at Suwanee. At the Man Up program, I gained a strong mentor in Jules Davis, who helped me discover more about the importance of friendship. Our goal at the Man Up program was to expand high school students' perspectives and views on what masculinity and manhood mean in their own lives. What I realized observing Jules was that what was most impactful about his work was the friendships he was able to create with people at Grundy County. He showed me that service was much more than a quantifiable impact we could have. I decided to continue my work with Bonner as site leader at Pelham Elementary School and to take the lessons learned from Jules to Pelham. The vivacity that Jules brought every day to our team and community at Grundy County High School, I was now ready to bring to my team at Activate. By leading physical activities including dodgeball, octopus tag, and car lot, we encouraged students from kindergarten to eighth grade to live an active life and make a positive difference for the Pelham community. Thank you, Sam, for coming so much because you're the best. And like, you have entertained us so much. And like, I'm thankful that y'all came and gave us more entertainment than any teacher that could have been here. I thought Sam was a really good influence for us and I hope he um, can come back anytime he wants. Sam was a very awesome man and um, he was really good. I had fun playing with him and I love the people that came here. I didn't hate anything. I loved everything. I loved the kindness and the games we played. And it is clear our team has made a positive impact upon the school. However, what has meant the most to me and which has also been the greatest influence I've had on the Grundy County community are the lasting friendships I will hang on to after my last day with Pelham. Similar to Jules' experience at Man Up, I found fulfillment in connecting with the students I have also served Suwannee's community by creating the Suwannee Rotary Club my junior year with the aim to provide our students with professional development, philanthropic, and service opportunities. Following my principles of friendship and community building, I was able to create a service organization of over 30 student members with the support of Bill Davis, a Rotarian, and Dean Gentry, the club's faculty advisor. Most importantly, eight students aligned their interests with our club and embarked on the journey of bringing Rotaract on campus as a leadership team. Since the club's founding, the Red Art Club has participated in a variety of service events, led three fundraisers totaling over $40,000 and hosted speakers. There have been two transitions in leadership with the club now on its third acting president. Rotaract's strong presence and impact has been bolstered by our team's ability to connect with our peers, community members, and staff. The friendships we have built enable us to serve and impact our community. This chapter of life has proven to be one about friendship and community. Though always having clear goals in mind, such as the number of students served, the amount of money raised, and the number of members retained, I've discovered that the greatest impact and most fulfilling aspect of my service has been made through my friendships and investment into people. Next year, I will be moving to Washington, D.C. to work as a technology consulting analyst for Accenture Federal Services. And though drastically different than pursuing a liberal arts degree on a mountain at Suwannee, 
My work will remain anchored by my belief in people and in creating the positive relationships and supportive environments I have invested in. At the end of our day, all people are remembered most by the memory our peers have of us and the relationships we are able to construct during our life, not necessarily by the quantifiable impact of our work and or time. The lessons I learned from Jules, my work at Pelham Elementary School, and the success of the Rotary Club have taught me a great deal about service and the fulfillment of investing and working with each other. Mr. Moon, Miss Donna, Lily, Emma, Reagan, Olivia, Will, Jacob, Caroline, Wes, Kelsey, Harry, Bill, Jules. The second that we realize life is not about me, but rather about us, is the second when we are able to leave our desired mark upon our community. Regardless where I am in my life, I know that the friendships I made within my Swanee community, my home, are the people I can count on most, and that realization has made all the difference.